Um, you know, um, through adversity going against the Army, um, that was pretty big for, for us as a team, you know. Um, that, that taught us how to be able to win in the fourth quarter. So, you know, um, we emphasized the whole season on winning in the fourth quarter. You know, we did a good job against Army. Now, tournament we have to, uh, against Tulsa, we have to play the whole game, you know, complete game, and be able to play first through the fourth quarter well to be able to beat these guys. Mm -hmm. Talk to me about how good the bye week was for everybody. You especially, I mean, it seems like everybody's got a little more pep, and it, we're good to have a week off. Um, it was good to have a bye week, you know, due to a lot of, um, you know, nick and neck injuries that um, some people had on the team. So, you know, um, we fresh. We're ready to get going against Tulsa, you know, so we can be 3-2. Mm -hmm. What's the key against Tulsa? What do you have to do offensively to be successful? Offensively, you know, you just have to be consistent consistent in the run game, consistent in the pass game, be able to, you know, have good execution against these guys because they're not a bad team. A lot of the games that, that they have lost, they, they came down to the wire in the fourth quarter, field goals, you know. Um, so they, they're a real good team. You know, we got to be able to execute and be disciplined. Mm -hmm. How much more confidence are you guys getting offensively? It seems like you guys are starting to sort of settle in, and it seems like it's getting a little more confident, I think. Um, yeah, um, we actually, you know, um, being able to be comfortable together, you know, um, getting to learn each other. So, you know, we obviously getting more confidence with each other. Um, some of the receivers getting more confidence with me, and I'm getting some more confidence with the running backs and alignment as well. So, you know, we are building as a team as far as chemistry.